says we're live. Okay, guys. So, I just got out of the shower. I was busy this morning getting some orders done, getting some stuff done. And I was like, I have time. Let me go get a shower really quick. So, I did it. I made it. We're here. Hi. Welcome to Swatch Fest. I still have my breakfast to drink. So, I'm just getting started on that. And I have three packages to open with you guys. So, I didn't think I'd have stuff here already from what I ordered the previous. I don't think I've purchased nail polish in a little while, so. That's probably not true. I just ordered from HHC on the 14th, so we all know that's not true. Hi, Liz. Hi, Yelly. Hi, Kristen. Hi, guys. Hey, Louise is here. Whoop, whoop. Louise is going to make sure there's no shenanigans in the chat. Hi, Jacqueline. I'm wearing my Mulan. My Mulan Let's Go Kick Some Honey Buns shirt. Hi, Rachel. Mulan did not make it into the Hero Princess collection, which is a tragedy because she is like probably the most heroic princess. Maybe not. Mulan is really heroic, but she's not really a princess. So I didn't include her because she's not a princess. Hi, Nicole. Hi, Nanette. Hi, Candace. Val. Chrissy. Hi. Yvette. Oh my gosh, Yvette. Hi. Welcome. That cap is always messy. I'm having clean, simple eats. Um, banana. Banana cream pie. Banana pudding. Something banana. I love banana. Mmm. I really like the Clean Simple Eats protein shakes. Um, and they're just by far better in taste than any other protein shake I've had. Coffee Life Nails Jerry. Jerry, how come you changed your name? Although I do like your name. Hi, Tammy. Hi, Vicki. No shenanigans. <laughs> Louise, it's actually extra shenanigans. Jessica, Kayla, hi Vicki, hi Lindsay. Okay, so I'm gonna start opening a package while we're waiting for a few more people to get here. I had to order a few items from the new uh, Once Upon a Time collection from PSE. She and I were just like so totally on the same wavelength for spring. As far as what we were inspired by. Whoa, whoa. There's a little card in there for polishing tips in case you're new to polish. That is very handy and cool. Okay. Pretty. You can change your name on here to your Instagram name. Okay. Hi, Nat. Hi, Michelle. Hi, Eva. Hi, Ika. Miranda in the house. Bite sized. Rose. JJ. Hi. You're making food. Okay. What are you making, bite sized? Natalie. Okay, good. Phew. You work in the hospital. Okay. Upside down. Look what I got. I got two yellows, a green, and the blue. So you know who else did not make it into my princess collection was Ariel. I don't know. Ariel has never been one of my faves. Um, but this is not Ariel. But this color made me think of Ariel. This is Jasmine. It's all so magical. She did make it into my collection. And this is so cute. So it's a jasmine tealy dusty green with gold flakies and black micro flakies. You live at this hospital, Natalie. Oh. You're eating a cream cheese filled carrot cake muffin. Are you kidding me? That sounds so good. Hi, Melissa. Hi, Quila. Everybody, Quila's birthday was yesterday. Okay, this is 
almost there because we're almost there tiana didn't make it into my collection either i'm so sorry tiana i'm so sorry um this is a green with a lot of gold to green shimmer it actually has like almost like a bronze gold green shimmer okay this yellow one ariel is your fave i'm so sorry i know i had a big boat i had a big poster of ariel up on in our playroom when i was a kid but <clears throat> she just didn't she didn't fit in my color scheme that's really why i chose to be blighted tail as old as time please wear a base coat oh that's fun that she puts that right on there so you can make sure to be careful i was super super excited for this one but that just means it has a ton of yellow pigment in it. Yellow pigment, like some other pigments, can be very staining. It just depends. So that's good. That's good to have that on there. We shall wear a base coat when we try that today. And one more yellow polish I got. You're going to grab them all in the restock. Awesome. Hey, Nicole, you got this whole collection except the green and yellow shades. <laughs> you got them all except the ones I got. Well, I got the ones I got because I have too many blue and purple and green polishes. Sunflower, also please wear a base coat. Okay, same story. Same story. So this has like micro flaky in it. This is micro flaky and this is glowy shimmer. And it's a very small particle size, which is why you can't see it standing out like that. And this is the charity polish, uh, Ukraine charity polish. I'm not sure if it's still going on, but if you'd like to go pick this up, um, to support her donation, but it's yellow and it has sunset. It basically has Pinkie Pie, but in shimmer form. So beautiful. I still have on that polish that we put on my earth, what that we put on my thumb last Saturday. Um, that's all the nail growth I've had in a week. And I just love this shade. My nails broke since last Saturday. I think, I don't think that, yeah, it was since last Saturday. So they are squares again, and yeah. I'm gonna put on a little bit of lotion of immortality. Hi guys, I'm broken. Beautiful Kazars and cacti, so many cacti. This was something I picked up at a polish pickup. This is kind of like a balm as opposed to like, um, like a lotion. And she always has new scents and I love this one. I think I got this when I was in person. Maybe not. I purchased a couple of her lotions when I was, I, uh, we went to the Portland show together. So the indie shop, the Portland indie shop, she was there on Anya is her name. I think, right. The maker of that brand. I didn't t tell you the brand, did I? Um, oh no, oh no, now it's not gonna come to my mind. If any of you guys can think of it for me. Oh, Lacquer. <laughs> Lucky 13, right? Lucky 13? Lacquer. I think it's a lacquer brand, I'm not sure, but it might be lacquer. Okay. What y'all wearing? I'm wearing Shady Pines, Ma. Oh, yeah. Just, Kayla, for some reason, I thought that your comment said, how's your nose job, Nicole? <laughs> oh, my gosh. My brain, my brain. How did I just roll over? A cord. I rolled over the cord. You're wearing the topper gin wishes? Oh, it's so sparkly. Yay. Now every polish you wear can be sparkly. You'll be wearing MSM Bachelor in Paradise tomorrow. Oh, Bachelor in Paradise. Okay, let me open another package. This is from HHC. Kayla, were you shocked at the ending of Bachelor? Were you shocked? I was actually really surprised it was Susie. Okay, all three of the polishes I ordered from HHC come in their own little boxes. Hi, Ashley. Hi, Nicole. Oh, sorry that 
You're wearing fancy gloss wedding vows sandwiched between a light pink jelly mm. for what? <gasps> How nice. Michelle's wearing Thunderstruck. Okay, I got Swamp Gloss. I'm cute as a button and can rhyme my ass off from the Hella Handmade Ted Lasso. You know, she puts a neon yellow in Hella Handmade Creations, and I just have to snag it. There's all of these fun black glitters, some on the larger side. We have multi-chrome flakies in there, too. So, I have three yellows in front of me right now. Actually, this one really kind of looks green. Look at my green screen thinks it's green, too. But we're going to pretend it's yellow. You bought Essie Ferris of them all whole collection swatches, but not worn yet. So pretty. Hi, Jackie. The next one I got is doo -doo 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 from Phoenix. I am fire. So this looks like it's maybe a reflective glitter topper. If I can open it because I just put that balm on my nails. Yeah, it's pretty sheer. It has a very sheer purple base. And then... Um, it says reflective glitter. I think she just put reflective glitter on there because it really is necessary with reflective glitter to wear a nice um, glitter smoothing uh, top coat or like two coats of top coat. Oh, look, nice. You can see that reflective glitter so well in the overhead. Um, in the overhead, blah, blah, blah. So it has gold and pink and red. Here it is. Looks like he's in there. So pretty. And the other one I got was from Penelope Luce because you know me, I'm obsessed. It's called Odori, Dance With Me. So she did like a separate box for her theme, Dance With Me. Cute. Um, this one is a pink. This is like normally the color that I shy away from, just to be totally honest with you. So I got this for you guys. <laughs> Not even going to lie. I love Penelope Loose, but um, this color of pink is not my jam. But it has this blue, strong blue purple shimmer. It's a linear hollow, it looks like. So we shall swatch it. You love that one, Kristen? You've been waking up at the wrong time all week, and today I overslept like crazy. I have been waking up at like 6.15 every day this week. Which is funny because the time zone change went the other way. I would love it if we got rid of the time zone. Is anybody with me with the um, time change? I would love that. To stay at where we're at right now. You love the sticker on my hand? Oh, thanks, Quila. I forgot it was there. It even stayed on um, in my shower. <laughs> I guess I'm not scrubbing the tops of my hands well enough in my shower. Um, you guys, it's like every day, so your chances of finding it on my hand are pretty high. Okay, so this next one is from Polish Gamers Box. Is Polish Gamers Box, yes, you still have two days left to shop Polish Gamers Box today and tomorrow. It's Halo themed. Did anybody watch the new Halo um, TV show? <clears throat> Alchemy Lacquer Maya Maya. Let's see. I think Alchemy Lacquer is going to be at Polish and Dreams. I'm so excited. There's so many brands that I get to meet at Polish and Dreams. If you're not a part of the Polish and Dreams um, Facebook group, but you want to be, but you're like, well, I'm not going, so I shouldn't join the Facebook group. Yes, you should. And let me tell you why. There are plenty of Polish um, fairies who can snag things for you. Maybe they're event exclusives. Um... Maybe there are brands that are going to release stuff early. For example, I'm releasing our, this is so gorgeous, my April collection one week early at the event. And you can just like be a part of the fun. Hang out and be a part of the fun. So, um, but I want to tell you guys, all of the all of the dreams, all of the um, brands that are coming. Do 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 Where is it? Where is it? And maybe you will decide last minute that you actually do want to come. Okay, so oh my gosh. Yes, alchemy lockers are right up at the top. Look at that. 
So Alchemy Lacquer, All Mixed Up Lacquer, Atomic Polish, Bluebird Lacquer, Chirality, Crypt Kitty Designs, Cuticula is going to be there, Dark Moon Essentials, Dark Skull Designs, Different Dimension, Fair Maiden Polish. If you want to meet the ladies who run Polish Pickup, there they are right there. Fan Chromatic Nails, Geekish Glitter, she runs Polished um, Gamers Box, that's very exciting. Girly Bits Cosmetics, Great Lakes Lacquer, so many awesome brands. Hearts and Promises, Jen and Berries, Kathleen and Co. Lacquer is in the air. Luna Lab, Moonshine Manny. I've already had them create this, or fix this typo, but not apparently on this document. Poetry Cowgirl, Rebellish. I don't know Rebellish yet. Red Eye Lacquer, Rogue Lacquer. She is running the event. Under a Hula Moon, Wandering Songbird, What Addiction, What's Up Beauty, and Zombie Claw. So, so, so excited. I have not been to a polish event where there are this many makers all in the one, on one place. It's so fun. So I'm actually going to be hosting a video next week where I'm going to be giving away tickets to the event for free as well. And I'm not sure if it's just for the Saturday. So there are five hours of shopping on Saturday and on the day before on Friday, there's workshops and the glitter gala where... I actually need to get more event or more info on what's happening there. Sorry, I've been showing this polish for a really long time, but it's not bad to look at. So, Maya Maya. Let's see if it's a swatcher. If it's a swatcher, if it's a topper. Ooh, I'm going to build that puppy up. Ooh, hoo, hoo, hoo. I need this flaky in my life. I don't have this one yet, I don't think, unless she's combined two different flakies here. It's like a red, pink, violet. Loving that. Hi, Kim. Jackie's going to be at the Chicago one. So if, um, if Vegas is too far for you, consider going to the Chicago one. Okay. Oops. I got three items from Polish Gamers Box. I don't know what this theme is. Maya Maya. I don't know what that is. The Dark Hour. Still don't know. Anybody remember February's Polish Gamers Box theme? Lemon Lacquer. I wish Lemon Lacquer was going to be there. This is so cool. This is a mossy olive with black to red multi-chrome flakes and shimmer. Ooh. Okay. And this one is a fuchsia pink. It, we probably should put it in purple, but I will probably end up putting it in pink. Oh, this is my first polish from Crisable Designs. So I'm super excited to swatch this with you guys. This is Oracle from Crisable Designs. Yay, a new to me brand. Totally new to me. Unless she's a previous brand that changed her name. Maybe you guys will have to tell me if that's the case. Okay, I think that you guys might be all arrived. Looks like we're low in numbers today, but that's okay. You ordered what and you can't remember? Oh, from this, from uh, Polish Gamers Box. Okay. <clears throat> Hi, Angela. Hi, Katya. You'll probably be going to the Chicago one, not sure yet, even though you live 45 minutes away. Oh, I hope you can go. It says O oh, Crisable. Not to me. Okay. Persona. She's a new brand from Canada. Fantastic. You're so ready for some neons. Awesome, Kim. Okay, I'm gonna pull out five random polishes from this biog. Uno, dos, la 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 la, let's dig down. Oh, speaking of neons, trace. got it this one's a little pink heavy sorry y'all are you going to show us sneak peeks what's launching next friday i can i'm thinking about doing a video though because there's two polishes for autism what was autism awareness now is autism acceptance duo this year there's two polishes for that and we're gonna have our facebook group exclusive of course 
designed by Miranda. And it's called Moonbeams in a Jar. Wait, did I show this last week, you guys? And the comeback is um, We Need an Adventure 2.0. What's the name of the group for the expo? Um, Polish and Dreams. Yes. Polish and Dreams. Dream to dream. Sorry. I'm just going to shake these up for a little bit. You went dark during winter. Ready for pastels, neons, and jellies. Yes, Angela. Do, 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 do. Sorry. I just want to present these polishes in the light that they looked when they came out. Okay. So, grab bag number one is going to be thus. It's going to be thus. Okay. Night Owl Lacquer. Awesome, awesome cream called Harvest. Oh, this is so delicious. I have a little owie on my thumb, apparently. Sorry if that's going to bother anybody. Awestruck. Oh, this one's so good. I thought they'd, they really hit a home run with this whole collection that this came from. Glam Polish. This is called Don't Be Such a Guppy. Oh, for all you Ariel fans. Oh, really? You do like them on your Zoyas? You don't mind if they stick up because mine don't go push like the Zoya ones? Yay, thank you for sharing that message, Elise. Polish Gamers Box is Persona. Yeah, I was reading a lot of blogs over the last couple weeks, and I decided to change the name of the autism polishes this year. Okay, this is, I'm probably good at this, dot, dot, dot. That's so 2020. So this is like inspired by how we all tried a bunch of new things in 2020 when we couldn't get to the store or to the salon or, and this is BCB Petal Dance. Oh, this one's so cool, you guys, because the green shimmer is really strong in this rose. It's super cool. I wish BCB was coming to Polish and Dreams. That would be incredible. Okay, so this is your first grab bag. I'm gonna put it over here. Grab bag numero uno. And I'm going to type the word go in just a second. And that's your signal to enter a number between 1 and 100. And you have to stick with the same number. You cannot change it. So there's my go. You wait for me to type it. And then your number has to fall between. I really need a brush. And your number has to fall between my typed go and my typed stop. Only choose one number. Um, please don't erase your number. If you see that somebody else picked your same number, you just have to stick with it. We're playing a game, and these are the rules of the game. Okay, for red, I'm going to layer up this bad boy. Maya, Maya, we're going to layer it up. Me too, Bama. Me too. Okay, so this looks like it's probably a topper. Yeah. Oh, isn't that gorgeous? I'm so obsessed with alchemy lacquer. Um, everything she does is incredible in case you were wondering. So there's a lot of black flakies in here, which are going to build up really nicely with that, um, iridescent flaky that we've got going red, pink, purple, and we're going to layer that up for three coats. And that's how, that's how I shall wear it. You could certainly wear it as a topper. Okay. For pink, I'm going to swatch this, even though it's violet, it's like a neon pinky violet but we're going to swatch it for pink because let's try Crisable Designs. So this is a new brand you can get at Polish. Uh, oh, it looks like they're at Polish Gamers Box. I don't know if she's on PPU. So that is fun. Are you guys all thinking about your spring activities? I have a, um, a thread in the Facebook group where you can go suggest images of things that you like to do for your spring activities as that was the most voted upon. This is cute. It's like a patriotic shred polish inside a violet um neon i have definitely never worn anything like that cute okay i need an orange oh i always have trouble finding an orange um we're gonna swatch this even though it's not orange oh that's cute louise okay this is kb shimmer not orange, but um, this is called Picture This. 
And this looks to be in a similar formula to the one we swatched last week, maybe. Micro Hollow Flakies and a very strong iridescent shimmer in a like fruit punch jelly base. Oh, come on. Oh, come on. Oh, no. Crystal Designs is in PPU. Yes, thank you. Come on. Come on. No. It's almost like a little bit of polish spilled out. Oh, dang. I always forget that when I put my lotion on right when we're starting, it makes it so it's really hard for me to open polish bottles. Come on. Oh, yeah, finally. I just had to tell it. I just had to be the boss of it. Okay. And if you love reflective glitter and want a whole collection of it, I believe it's a whole collection of reflective glitter. That's um, KB Shimmer's newest collection. That must be so much reflective glitter that she bought <laughs> in order to do a whole collection of reflective glitter. Wow, that's pretty. I mean, it is actually kind of working for orange because there's so much gold green shimmer in there. Oh, I don't have any. I don't have any. Are you kidding me? Um, pads. And I also don't see any scissors. Wow. I'm really prepared. Just saying. It's spring in full force. You're swatching your daughter's room. What does swatching it mean? Okay, let's swatch this charity polish. Oh yeah, we gotta wear a base coat. Let us wear some base coat. I'm gonna wear it with all about that base, just for fun. It's gonna, it's gonna change the opacity of the polish, but that's okay. That's okay, that's okay. I'm trying to decide if I need to go to the Tulip Festival this year, you guys. Do I need to go to it? I don't know. I do need to find scissors and cut myself up some uh, felt. I'm gonna say it again. Instead of buying cotton swabs, I much prefer to remove my polish with felt. So there's even a more cost effective way than doing it this way, which is just going and buying it by the yard like at Walmart. But I can never find people there. What was on my hand? Oh. I can never find a t like um, workers there that are available to help me. So usually I just prefer to run into Michael's really quick and grab this. This is a 36 by 36. I don't know how big that is. That's like a half yard. I don't know. Maybe it's a full yard. I don't know. But I <coughs> really love it for polish removal. So if you're new, this is how, this is, I haven't done like a, my polish go-tos or whatever kind of video in forever. Um, but this is my recommendation to you, especially if you hate the feel of cotton pads, you hate the little thingies that you inevitably always get on yourself. And then you just cut a big long strip and then you cut it. And then you're good to go. And it is it has like a lot more grip. So when you go to remove stuff, you, it, I just think it works really well. So that is the deal. Okay. Okay. I forget what I was getting this for. I think I was just getting prepared. Okay. So we're going to swatch sunflower. Yes. It doesn't leave it. I mean, it's occasionally it leaves a little bit, but it's not as bad. So this sucker has so much rad red in it. I believe it's rad red. And I love that shimmer. I love it, I love it, I love it. So pretty. Do you just toss it when done? Yes, 
I don't reuse my felt pads. I love that it always gets mad at you guys for saying nude. Okay, there's your stop. Yeah, Rebecca, you made it. Oh, Honor's texting me. Oh my gosh. That was just a long text of nothing. You know, like how when you just type the middle button on your phone and it just types words. Okay. So, remember you're looking for the closest number to the random generated number without going over. So, because of the internet, all the numbers are going to show up in a slightly different order. So, if you know you typed 78, you might not be the winner because somebody else might have typed it before you. We're going to go off of majority rules because the internet is going to show us all different at different times. And um, so, I need at least 20 people to agree on the same name. And Louise is going to break the tie for us. We're going back in with Alchemy Lacquer Maya Maya. I don't even think you're going to need three coats on this guy. I mean, you could, but I really like it like that. Ooh. Ooh, job. So pretty. So pretty. Loving this hand. Love it. La, 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 la. That's pretty similar to Ushiny's, yes, except this is more red heavy and Ushiny's was more pink, gold, green. But you are very correct. You are very correct. Okay. So, Bachelor is over. What other show should I be watching right now, guys? My Trash TV polo group were like, oh no, what are we going to talk about now? Okay, we have a little bit of discrepancy, so I need at least 20 people to please comment with who you see as first in your chat. Oh, this one's beautiful. Oh, oh this one's beautiful. Oh, it's so beautiful. Jackie says she's a glitter girl. And a second coat of She's My Sunflower. I think a lover can't be too much. Okay. Gorge. Here's the finished hand. We're going from light to dark. Broom, broom. So fun. Oh, Hannah's giving us a tip. Drag race this season is just nonstop. Where can I watch that, though? Computer, what are you trying to do? Stop putting windows up. Yep, that's what happens, Chrissy. You started watching Pretty Little Liars, and it's so American. <laughs> I haven't seen that show. Ooh, 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 ooh. Okay, so do we have Casey? I see that most people said it was Casey. There's a dating game, Lucy Blaze. I saw that. Michelle, is it called the court, or Miranda, is it called the, the courtship? I saw that one. Oh, I got all of the winner's prizes out. Yay. So we're going to delete that. Okay, today is 319. Grab bag one. Is gonna be Casey. Yay, Casey. I haven't sent you anything in a little while. Whoop, whoop. Make sure you're on live chat, says Louise. Ooh, strawberry lemonade. Yes, 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 yes. Hi, Kate. Kate, it looks like the noon time slot is the winning time. So we will be having, I didn't mention this before, we'll be having our mix-along 
next Saturday, let me check my calendar. Next Saturday, yes, the 26th at noon Pacific Standard Time is when we're gonna start. So, still on the fence, but you'll keep watching. Miranda, did you watch um, Joe Millionaire? Because I was really iffy about that at first, and then I ended up liking it because it was so cute, the friendship that formed between the two main guys. Okay, so we've got Casey. So, Casey, I need you to email me at moonshinemanycontact at gmail.com and tell me your address and um, you get the two polishes you pick from that lineup, okay? The next giveaway is going to be for the video that was on my channel this week, Color Club. Um, why can't I ever remember this name of this collection? It's something about being hot. <laughs> Feeling hot, hot, hot. In any case, there are six beautiful reds. Six beautiful reds are ready to come home with you. So. Oh no, you love 12 EST. I'm sorry, JJ. I said I would let people vote after three months and I did. I'm sorry, Nicole. I can't make everyone happy. It makes me so sad. <laughs> makes me so sad I can't pick a good time that's good for everybody sigh you just finished love is blind yeah I mean um the batch the Joe Millionaire one was like at first probably like the first four episodes were really kind of a mess hi S you love that collection the um color club one Okay, so this this one's going to be a giveaway for that. You're going to be able to pick your top two polishes from that whole collection. And I purchased it at headtotoebeauty.com. I tried looking for the code, you guys, that they gave me for you guys to shop there. But um, it expired at, in 2022. So I don't have a code for you. But they always have a 5% off code on their website. And it's already, like, a really great deal when you shop there. So use the 5% off code. You'll find it on the main page. 1.30 PST. I'm sorry, Louise. Aw, JJ. Well, Kristen, I have um, people that let me know that they're sad about this time pretty much on a weekly basis. So I wanted to be fair and open it up for a poll like I said I would. Oh, <laughs> You have a tea you're going to. Okay, so grab bag two is going to be for Color Club. Do, 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 do. Maybe we'll do three months at this time and then we'll take a vote again. Maybe we'll do that. Or maybe I'll find that the noon is just too hard for me and I'll switch back. I don't know. Okay. We did it at noon for a whole year. Okay, so or over a year. This is the video you're looking for on my channel. If you want to look at these polishes and see which ones are for you. So look for that. All red. All red all day. Slay all day. Okay. So here is your go for your second giveaway. We move on to... Green. Let's do this lemon lacquer. Ooh, so good. The dark hour. The dark hour from Persona. I don't know the game Persona. What kind of game is Persona, you guys? Oh my gosh, look at this nail. <gasps> look at how peely it is. I wonder what happened to this nail. My Cinderella hand is like, <laughs> but notice me. I'm in terrible shape too. No, but this one nail is like peeling all the way up to the edge maybe I had some damage to this nail that I just don't remember that's sad that's so sad okay thanks Kristen okay so this mossy olive jelly with multi-chrome flakies going black to red 
has the potential to steal my heart. I love olive polish, as you know, and we shall layer that up and see. Red isn't your jam, so good luck to everyone else. That's sweet, Koila. I could always, you could always send them to a friend too if you wanted to enter. Give them to a mother or a sister or a brother, or what other? What else rhymes with mother and brother? Or another, another polish fan? Okay, blue. Let's find a blue. I'm gonna do. Mm, let's just slide over here. Don't stop me now. I want a good time. Did we already swatch polish? I don't think we did yet, right? Doesn't call on a good time. Defying the laws of gravity. Okay. Look at this bad boy. This is called. Can't read. Shake your buoy. And all of the flakies have matriculated, matriculated, migrated to a couple of the corners, but we'll still get some out. But it makes it really easy to see what the cool flakies are. When your polish sits in the bottle, it sometimes usually does that. So, this is from Painted Polish. If you didn't know that logo, and it is a jelly teal. I think it's from her collection of teals. She has a collection of periwinkles available right now. I think that's a re-promote from maybe last year. And this year ended up being periwinkle as the color of the year. So I think that's why she's re-promoting it. So you have another chance to snag it. Okay. This might end up being another polish that's not really a purple. New Year's Eve 2021 called Pop-Up Video. There's a lot going on in here. Any tricks for getting flakies off the sides? Usually, even though you're, you're seeing that your flakies are on the sides, it's not very likely that the brand has put in so few that you're not going to get just as many out when you pull out your brush. Okay, this one is a blackberry jelly base with hollow flakies and fiery iridescent flakies. But I see your point because I did get not as many flakies here, but I don't remember that when I bought this polish, but it might be that that's the intended look and I'm just seeing like a lot of them collected in one spot on the side of the bottle. So my recommendation would just be putting it in a polish mixing machine probably, she says, as she does not have a polish mixing machine. Okay, for neutral, we're gonna swatch Jinx. I think this one also has a hollow version. Does that sound right, you guys? Oh, is this purple? I thought it was black. I think this is actually a purple base. That's okay, yep, it is, but I have so much purple, so we're just gonna swatch it. So this is from ILNP. This is called Jinx. Here's how we're shaping up so far. You use a magnet to grab the mixing balls and move them around. Very cool, JJ. Do. I just don't like skinny brushes at all. I have to do too many swipes up and down my nail and end up pulling the polish off. Okay. So there's those. We're going to say stop. Take a magnet, grab the steel balls of the magnet through the glass and run the balls to the sides to knock out the flakies. Very cool, Quila. And JJ. Okay, the second winning number is got your boards out, got your daubers. 53. 53. It's too sheer though, so I use a similar base color, says S. As I missed what polish you were talking about originally. Let's see. Hi, Flory. Hi, hi, hi. 
I didn't see which one you were talking about us. Oh, Jinx. It was like literally the comment before me. Okay. I'm gonna do a second coat. This first one is The Dark Hour by Lemming Lacquer. La, 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 Lemming. She got a lemon lemon for this lacquer. So I am going to film a floss tube video. I've been telling you guys for a few weeks that I was going to do it. I'm waiting for one more thing to arrive um, before I start the video. I want to try the parking method that I never heard about. I can see the shift in these flaggies and it's gorgeous. Um, it's not showing up well in this lighting, but it's real pretty. I want to try the parking method, which I had never heard of. It's basically like being able to like stitch your cross stitch like you're a, like you're a printer or whatever um <laughs> and i'm waiting for this one uh design to arrive before i give that a go but i am gonna film it i am i am i am some of you like slim brushes so sorry about that so sorry but we are totally good to disagree, my love. Okay. So pretty. So pretty. That's so pretty. It's it's more gorgeous in person, even. It's a really beautiful combo. Really gorge. Really, 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 really gorge. Okay. Looks like it's gonna be Candace. Ooh, ooh, Candace. Ooh, that's how you do cross stitch, Chrissy, darling. Chrissy, are you on Floss Tube? Do you want to suggest any favorite um, channels to me? Cause I found quite a few in the last couple weeks, but I definitely have my faves so far. The people that I be vibing with. This polish is really cool. There's quite a crazy mix of stuff going on in this shade, and. It's probably very limited edition, right? Because it came out for 2021 New Year's. I'm trying to get you to be able to see some of the different angles there. It's Pinkie Pie, but there's also some green going on in there. Yay! Yay, yay, Candace! Okay, and then the fourth one we did was Jinx. Jinx. Monsoon. Maybe this is who, that's who this polish is named for, Jinx Monsoon. Okay. Beautiful. You don't know what that is? It's okay, Chrissy. I didn't know what that was either. And I have been cross-stitching since I was 12 years old. And I didn't know what that is. So you will find out soon. Because I'm bringing it to a channel near you. Namely, my channel. Okay. I'm going to let you gaze upon that manicure for a short time longer. Now you're into junk journaling. Awesome. Junk journaling. Tell us, tell us what junk journaling is in one sentence. Sum it up for me, boo. So as to not take up too much of your energy. And explaining this to this noob. Okay, Candace. I hope you like red, Candace. I hope you like red. And I have, you know how I always tell you that um, Color Club launches three collections at a time? Well, this time they launched two. My watch is telling me to stand up. And the other one, as opposed to the all red one, the second one is called Ride or Die. And... It looks like this. So here's hot and heavy. Ride or die is like this. It's like totally a fall collection. I don't get it why they're releasing it right now. But I'm not mad about it because I love fall colors. But I'm not going to want to wear any of these till like September. Uh, probably more like August. So we've got a couple greens or two reds. Maybe like a burnt orangey brown. An orange and like a greenish ivory it looks like. In fact... <laughs> me so so silly I have them right here we can gaze upon them so ooh, this is like a rich emeraldy jade 
a grayish green, like a cactus or um, succulent color, a very fiery red, which is like, why are you doing another red? Okay, whatever. Yes, it is like a ginger snap, kind of ginger snap rosy brown. This one, the one that I said was a greenish ivory, that is pretty. It's a, it's like a grayish, but barely any gray. So it's actually like, that's a pretty good grayish right there. And then this one shall be my least favorite, but I'm sure it will still have just as beautiful of a cream formula as the rest. Focus. Focus, I tell you. Focus, I say to you. Okay. Okay. So anyway, we're going to look at that this week. Um, members to the channel, we will probably have a live swatch of that on Monday or Tuesday, depending on when the, Zo the new Zoya Spring Collection comes out or arrives here. It launched. Is it called Abundance? It launched on the 15th, I think. But it's still not here, so I can't swatch it for you yet. Um, but I'm going to wait to do the Color World Club one until that arrives so we can do them both at the same time. Okay? Okay. All righty. All righty. Let's see. You could go for a ginger snap cookie. <laughs> you know, Gretla, I have some in my pantry still leftover from Christmas time. They're a little, um, <laughs> they're like, uh, individually wrapped ginger snap Christmas trees that apparently my children didn't like enough to finish. And every day I go to my pantry and think, I really need to clean out my pantry today. And then I don't do it. Bring on some members only vids. What, 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 what? Zoya Abundance just launched on the 15th, Kayla says. Yes. Cement gray. Yes, Bama. Let's look at that again. Hmm. I think you're right. It's a very good beigey stone. Beigey stone. Quietly, are you going to make some ginger snap? Hello to Italy. How are you doing? Um, no, it's head to toe beauty. The only thing I really shop for at 88 Beauty is, what do I shop for at 88 Beauty? I'll look it up in one second. Do, do, oh, is um, Essie. Sometimes they have Essie collections there faster than um, like Polish Pick. So sometimes I'll swatch there for at head to toe or at 88 beauty, but everything else I either shop at head to toe beauty or polish pick. Oh, I missed the junk journaling sum up. Let me find it. Junk journaling. You have a bunch of shows that only did a single season before the pandemic. Angela, that's so frustrating. Yes, we be crafty, Chrissy. Yes. Louise says, I do Halbonichi, which is like creative journaling, somewhere between normal and junk. And Candace says, I have red hair. So, yes. Um, where is the response about the junk journaling? Michelle, my gal, tell me your answer. Tell it right now. Oh, there it is. Junk journaling is working in and creating a journal using what others consider the junk of life. Repurposing junk mail, ticket stubs, anything paper related. So this is this all your junk or do you like go to work and like sort through the trash? Oh, geez. My hair is just falling out. Like how do you find other people's junk? Back to painting. Okay, mama. Yes, head to toe beauty, Nicole, because you can shop there for Orly, China Glaze, and Color Club at the same time. Also, they have some Morgan Taylor, and you guys know how much I like that. Okay, so next, grab bag number two. This is our third giveaway. You just watched me swatch all of these. This is a flaky, heavy giveaway. I'm going to put in a cream just to balance it out in just a second. Ooh, wow, just a bunch of powerhouse polishes right there. Let's give a cream to make it, ooh, Oh, I think we did that one last week. Let me find another one. 
Speaking of Morgan Taylor, plant one on me. I love Morgan Taylor creams. They are just so fantastic to work with. So you just watch me swatch all these, okay? So this is grab bag number three. And I'm moving it, okay? If you win this one, you might have to rewind to go see what was in the giveaway. But that's aight. That's aight. Okay. Organization. That's what we need, people. Trying to organize. Uh-oh. Honey, can Joy get that maybe? I'm working on it. Thank you. Honor's coming home from her um over and the front door is still locked. Whoops. No, my junk. I use paper scraps like tissue paper from your polish orders. Okay, cool. <laughs> Chrissy's eyes are turning into stars. Oh, thanks. Indirectione non casual. <laughs> How bad did I say that? I don't, I don't know if I have tried. I did have a subscriber send me a bunch of stuff. Um, listening to. She already come in. Hey, Joy, please go open the front door. I'm going to check on honor on the front door. Okay. So ready, set, go. Please, uh, what you, when you email me winners, please tell me your address, even if you've given it to me before, so that I make sure I send it to the right spot. She's standing out there with her blankets and everything. What's up, babe? <laughs> Sounds like Joy's stomping her way all the way to the front door. That's a really cute face. Jim's teasing me, you guys. Okay. The third child has finally been let in. Okay, we are back to the top of the rainbow. So, let's see here. We didn't swatch Night Owl Lacquer yet. Let's do Blood Dragon. January Polished Gamers, Blood Dragon. Okay. Whoa, got a little too much on my brush. Ooh, so this has really beautiful blue to violet flaky. I think, and actually, I might be thinking of the wrong polish. I'm not gonna over speak what I was just about to say. Okay. Gorge. Soup's Gorge. Let's do, oh, did I already do Penelope Loose? That's okay, because I want to do it again. I want to swatch this pink. Oh, no. I forgot it. Phew. Phew. Okay. Ooh, that is so pretty. Okay, I know I said this was not my cup of tea, but there's so much soft shimmer in here and it's got like this little twinkle to it. It's like almost a mix between a glow shimmer and a twinkle shimmer. So maybe she actually has two that are really similar. I don't know, but it's so sparkly and then it's holographic too. Oh, that's so pretty. Okay, I always need an orange. Note to self, buy more orange polish. All right, this is not orange, but we're gonna swatch it. Actually, because I just spied it out of the corner of my eye and I had been wanting to watch the swatch it. Chip, chip, hooray. Oh my gosh. I was so in love with this polish when she made it. I was like, ah, I love that so much. Hi, Danielle. You love those flakies? The one that's in here? Mm-hmm. Okay. So this is the one that she... Uh, inspired after the, that Tostitos Salsa that's like a magenta color or something. <laughs> that ended up being like such a cute month even though the inspiration really like I puzzled over that for a little while what I was going to do. 
Okay, for yellow, we're gonna swatch this swamp gloss. I'm cute as a button. Should I watch that show? Ted Lasso, who here loves that show? Is that a must watch? I'm about to mess up this hand by swatching this because it's yellow green and these three look so nice together. <laughs> oh well. Pretty. Pretty, pretty, pretty. Hi, Hannah. Pretty, pretty, pretty. Oh, Kristen, you just sneaked in, in the nick of time. You love Ted Lasso. A resounding yes from Leslie. You want to watch Ted Lasso? Oh, I don't have Apple TV. I thought it was on HBO Max for some reason. Well, darn, I guess I'm not watching Ted Lasso. You guys, I have so many stinking subscriptions. <laughs> what do I need to watch on Brit, Brit Box? I'm currently binging my way through Wallander and loving it, but what should I watch after that? Okay, did I take notes? Grab bag two. It was gonna be. I finally watched Don't Look Up. It's gonna be my. Yes, it's a must watch. Oh, shoot. I don't wanna subscribe to Apple TV 48. You think I would love it? Poirot. I've seen most of those Poirots. Season one is free. Hmm. You have chip chip for eight? Okay, so you guys are looking for 48. Closest without going over. You got it just to watch Servant. Is Servant so good? That show gives me the creeps just looking at the, the cover image of it. Vera, Shetland, both are awesome. Thank you, Kathleen. Okay, watching Blood Dragon. Second coat of Blood Dragon, Louise's favorite polish of the swatch so far today. Blood Dragon. Blood Dragon. Louise, why do you never enter the giveaways? I'm just thinking right now that I've never sent you a win to any of these. Why don't you enter, you silly? You could win Blood Dragon. <laughs> Michelle, 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 Michelle. Okay, let's watch Penelope Luce again. Do you guys ever get close to finishing a show and then you don't finish it on purpose because you don't want to be done with it? Does that ever happen? Louise, I was also a little afraid to be disappointed by Rupert Grint in that show. That's silly, right? You like it, so that's good. Oh my gosh, I'm obsessed with this polish. I'm obsessed. This one, this one. Who was saying that they have this and they haven't tried it yet? You need to try it. Get it out today. Wear it with me. Aw, Louise. You hate that? That's the first time I've ever called you that. You're like, um, actually, yes. Please never utter it again. Okay. Swamp gloss. Come right up on my pinky nail. So pretty and bright. Do, 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 do. Do, 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 do. So I saw a comment that somebody, a few people are saying that they want a whole collection full of dragon fruit, um, pack, dragon fruit sorbetto. And I could totally do that if you guys are into that. Um, that is the best selling polish out of our own Hawaii collection, like by far. So I'm really glad you guys are loving it. And I didn't know everybody would be into neons already in March, but I'm so glad you're loving it. It's been, I know, Nicole, yeah. You haven't finished It's Creek, I know. I actually did finish that, but I didn't want to. Okay, a lot of people do that. Um, for future ISOS, like you want me to put it in um in the 
description of the video? I could. That would take a lot of time though and I already go over by a lot. Okay, let me write down the winner. Hello, Nick is trash is in the channel. Ian, what up? Yay, I'm so glad you could finally make it to a live. You're just in time for our fourth and fifth giveaway. You need a whole collection. Oh, I'm glad you like it, Nicole. You're no longer a big fan of black glitter flakies for spring, summer. Good to know. You love the Penelope Loose polish. Okay, Michelle, I'm writing your name down. Now I have to choose though. That's the hard part about being the winner of the giveaway. Okay. Grab bag number three. If you are somebody who has been wondering when my next D stash is going to take place, that will be probably in June. You got your bottle yesterday of what? Oh, of dragon fruit? Okay, say goodbye to these lovelies. Bye bye. Thanks for joining us today. Who could it be now? Who could it be now? Dun 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 dun. Okay. So. I was talking about doing that giveaway video for Polish and Dreams. Make sure you come. I always like it when you come watch my videos, even if you're not planning on going to Polish and Dreams. But if you would like a chance to win tickets to a Polish and Dreams, I have to get more of the specifics on that. But definitely come check out the video and enter the giveaway. I'm so excited to meet some of you at the event. It's going to be awesome. And Stacy is coming with me, and you will probably get to see the kiddos there as well not Salem and Lincoln they're going to be on spring break road trip with their dad okay nails are clean okay let's see yeah next giveaway we need a couple more polishes and cool one. Okay, we have a nails ink called Not From Concentrate. And I have Blood Dragon. I'm cute as a button. The Ted Lasso polish. We're going to pop it in here. And this Odori, because I told you guys, even though it was so gorgeous, I bought this for you guys. Pretty much any pink polish I'm buying for you guys. Oh, I wasn't really planning on doing a video of the D stash. I guess I could. What's your favorite thing about videos of D stashes, Tammy? Lucerne. Remember we swatched this last week? Okay. So here's grab bag number three. Okay, grab bag number three. Number three. Aw, thanks, Jessica. Okay, ready, set, gizzy, go. Well, Michelle, it's mostly going to be, so I've pretty much pared down my mainstream collection as much as I'm paring it down. Whenever I review a new collection, I put the things I'm not planning on keeping in the D-stash area. But this D stash is going to be a lot, uh, I think maybe before it was like 60% mainstream or even maybe 70%, 30% indie. Um, this is going to be much more 50-50. So I have yet to figure out what the price point is going to be and all that stuff. I just, hi, Pink Karen. Um... So, yeah. You wish the giveaway had airfare? Oh, I know, Wendy. The airfare is just ridiculous right now. So, 
I happen to be really lucky that I color comparisons if a polish is discontinued. That's your favorite thing about D-Stash videos? Um, watching nail polish. <laughs> so do you mean like pull out a Helmer drawer and like film myself deciding if I want to de-stash it or not? Hey, girlfriend. <laughs> I know, JJ. And sometimes I'm like, I literally just purchased this. This is silly, but it's actually not silly because I love gifting. It's one of my love languages. And it makes me really happy to think about you guys getting these polishes and enjoying them. So. Don't be in awe. It's just something I really like. Yeah, Louise. What, what? Okay, so there's a hair. This hair shall not be included in your package. It's not part of the giveaway. Can you just state that up front? <laughs> Sorry if there is a hair in your package. Okay. So you guys are entering. Louise, I saw you and I was like, oh, so cute. All right, we're gonna do a green polish. And we already did polish for days. So let's see, y'all. Yeah. Green for St. Patty's Day. indigo it's going to suffice for blue actually as I bring it over it looks more navy okay cool okay cool so I'm listening to book one of the Bridgerton series in preparation for season two coming Friday and I am reading it with my girlfriends from before I moved here and it's really fun The 10 second, oh yes. And when I did that, Kristen, that was when I was like majorly paring down my collection. So I don't really have a whole like series of videos really that I could do with that at this time. Okay, we're gonna swatch this sucker who has been in my stash forever untried, if it will focus. This is KL Polish Capricorn. And it is green to bronze duochrome. Let's see if we can see the bronze. Yes, it does. It makes me very happy, JJ. Okay. Get off my finger. The girls have to clean up all the dog poo poo in the backyard. Um, uh, no. In my opinion, Michelle, no. It's not worth getting Netflix for. But that's... It's really cute. Like, if you already had Netflix, I'd say, yeah, go watch it. But... Especially because you can just read it. I mean, buying it on Audible is actually probably more expensive than a Netflix subscription. But if you just pick up a paperback in Barnes & Noble, that was $8. I got both of them, just in case. My um, It's worth than getting someone else's Netflix. <laughs> okay, I can see the red when I go up like this. So green to red, that looks really pretty. Okay. I don't want to lose the numbers. Let's say stop. 
Strange color for Capricorn, says Flory. Hi, Alana. What's up? Okay. The winner for grab bag three is 67. Grab bag three, is that right? Yeah, 67. Okay, we're looking for the closest to 67 without going over. So, so far we did Capricorn from KL Polish. Outer Banks is worth getting Netflix for. Okay, Rose. That is my friend Sarah, who swatches and designs for Moonshine Manny. That is her, like, very favorite show. So, I guess I should watch it. I just, from looking at the preview, it looks like it's about teens. And I have a really hard time with teenage drama. Is it about teens? Okay, I'm going to tell you what this is in just a second. I realize I neglected to tell you. Who doesn't love navy and copper together? They are such an awesome combo. Okay, this polish. You can. Oh, I didn't make you guys guess who the brands were we did this week. That was fun last week. This is Sheriff from Native War Paints. Like Omar Sharif. Just kidding, it's spelled like this. Okay. You're a Capricorn, and this just doesn't ring true for you, huh? Is there Capricorn is not the one. That's um that's the two fishes, right? That's Pisces. Okay, for purple we're doing <gasps> I just love her so much. Her logo makes me so happy. This is called Fluorite All Right All Right. Fluorite All Right All Right. January. Hey, Pink Karen! The Crown is worth Netflix. Okay, I've also not watched The Crown. Uh. I'm bad. I watched almost all of season one. I really need to pick that one back up. Oh, this is pretty. Purple with pink shimmer and a rainbow of flakies in there. That is pretty. Hey, yay, Pink Karen! Doo doo doo. One second. Oh. oh, okay. Pink Karen, choose a pink. Is there any pink in there? There is some pink. Today is my Pisces, Megan says. Goat is Capricorn and birthstone is Garnet. Well, it's red at this angle, but that is interesting. Okay, for neutral, we're going to do Zinking of You from Simple Colors. Zinking of You. Let's try it out. This is perfect for next month's polish pickup. Periodic table of elements, of which I chose iron, but really rust. And making a rusty hollow for you. I like that. That's pretty. Matthew McConaughey's All Right, All Right, All Right. Like that. What show does he say that on? You're a Leo and you have no idea why everyone makes orange polishes for a lion. Michelle, yes, I'm definitely going to do orange for Leo now. JK, I'm also a Leo. We should always have purple polishes for Leos, duh. Okay, there are green garnets, Alana said. Alana, thank you for sharing that with us. Okay, Karen, what are you going to choose? It's so hard. If this is not Karen's first win, it's been a while since she's won something. Karen, we missed you. Okay, that's a second coat of Capricorn from KL. That is really pretty. Okay. It's from Dazed and Confused, the movie. I 
didn't even know he was in that movie. Maybe I haven't seen that movie. This is Sheriff. If you love glitter curlies, this is such an iconic combo here with this copper and navy. Oh, so gorgeous. Love that. Give me a nice glitter top coat and that will be insanely gorgeous. If you guys couldn't tell by TGIBF, I love copper and navy together. Woo, that's so pretty. Okay. Then sweet and sour lacquer, fluoride, all right, all right. We need poop, we need poople because we're royalty. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> we're going to have a Leo Parte. Leo Parte in our birth month. Okay, that was his first movie? Wow. 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 Oh. Okay. Parker Posey is in Dazed and Confused. So is Sean Penn, right? I need to watch that. We started watching Peacemaker last night. <laughs> I just I have like um like a meter like as much foul language that I can handle and I just with that show and there's some other shows where it's just like the barrage of it I'm just like okay this isn't enjoyable anymore when the only word that you can think to say is the f word it just starts to wear me down so I watched a couple episodes but Tim will need to finish that show on his own because I like the mysterious premise of what they're doing and like I don't want to spoil any of it but like the creatures that they're ch chasing and stuff and people but I just wish that it wasn't weren't so just like that's how it feels when I'm watching it <laughs> I don't know why just like uh nah mm's book green lights is good especially on audiobook you love his voice mm Aw, thanks, Kim. I really like it. Who's M.M.? The soundtrack to Dazed and Confused is better than the movie. The movie. Don't forget, you guys, next Saturday is going to be a Swatch Fest mix-along. We're going to create four polishes together. Louise, I don't have enough oranges in my stash. Like, I never have oranges so pretty much whenever I see an orange on PPU or HHC, I buy it because I agree. Oranges is really, they're really not done that much. Okay. Um, oh, bye Jackie. We'll miss you. Um, I'll look up that soundtrack. Oh yeah. But don't forget, be thinking this week, what you want to make for next Saturday. And remember that we're not going to start till noon Pacific. Okay, so it's not like you can be late to it because it's not before anymore, but still. Sounds like the girls are grudgingly going outside to clean up after the doggos. Okay, Matthew McConaughey, you're looking for burnt oranges. Okay, do, 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 do. Okay, this is this the last giveaway? Let me check my notes. Oh, did I not say stop? Did I say stop? Uh oh. Wait, pink, Karen. Okay. Phew! I thought I screwed the pooch. <laughs> oh my gosh, can you guys hear Tim? <laughs> okay giveaway number four this is the final giveaway of the day the day i hear you <laughs> okay bye babe happy international quilt day everyone says kim i think so kayla 3 p.m est yes spring is Springtivities. Theme is Springtivities. 
Wait, I didn't say go yet, guys. I actually didn't show you the polishes yet either. <laughs> so hold on. Hold, please. Pretty, pretty. Oh, that one's so pretty. Shake it up. Shake it up, baby. Shake it up, baby. TV shows on BritBox. Miss Fisher's Murder Mysteries. Dead Still. Dalglish. Rose Hall. Endeavor. Spanish show. The Vineyard. Okay. Thank you so much. Yeah, everyone check your library system if they use Overdrive for free audio books or ebooks. So true. When I was in California, I used that a lot. Okay, so give away grab bag number four. Let's move it into the frame. This is Cupcake Polish Unrequited Love, The Vault 2016. And this one is like a deep brick, like a deep, deep brick with this really awesome sparkle. Like it looks like the top of the water. It's so beautiful i didn't even remember about this polish at all it's so gorgeous i think it's platinum flaky there with that it is so gorgeous um kind of along the same line here so but we have this deep beautiful deep burgundy with these teeny tiny um fuchsia hollow glitters in there and then hollow like additional hollow i think no man's land and then we have sensational from glam polish I need to order me some glam since I stopped swatching for basically any brand I have missed out on what she's been doing for the last four or five months sensational sorry I didn't show you but it's like a soft turquoise with tons of pink uh, flakies in there I think it's pinkie pie and then it's violet shimmer and then this one, which we just watched, Zinking of You, so pretty, and Sheriff from Native War Paints. So that's your grab bag number five. Fun little mix here. I'm now going to pick some polishes to wear for the rest of the day. Platinum Flakies are so underrated. You love them. And JJ says, Miss Fisher is so fun. You think I'd like it? Okay, cool. Is it the one... What about the one that shows the nun riding on the bike? Has anybody tried that one? Hi, Lucia. Lucia Splendors. Based on One Hit Wonders. Aw, oh, that's fun. That's super fun. Okay, so now we're going to say go. If you're new to, if this is your first mix along, you're entering a number between 1 and 100. You're trying to get the closest to the random generated number without going over. Okay. I'm going to pick a brand to wear do, 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 or color. I'm trying to go with teal, guys, so I'm looking for a bunch of teals. Do, do, do. Do, do, do. Do, do, do. This one is going to need some base corsa. Mm, that's not teal. Mm, mm. That's like a deep teal. 
Sweet Magnolias, I think is what it's called. Okay. Do, firstly, we're starting off with Painted Polish Mystery Crelly Catorce. We're actually going to start with the pinky this time. <gasps> That's so pretty. Okay, Katya. Um, what show have you watched a million times? Next is Polish for Days. It's also magical, which I opened at the very beginning of the video. Whoa, it's really, really crammed with um, bright gold iridescent flakies. Wow, that's opaque. That's opaque for a Crelly, and it's because she has so much flakies in there. Okay, now we're going to do polish. Do, 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 do. 88 Countach. That's probably not how you say it. Has a rainbow of flakies in there. Oh, that color. The colors on those flakies are so beautiful, you guys. Watch Call the Midwife. What's my favorite polish brand? <laughs> right now, I'm pretty much crushing super hard on Penelope Loose and Alchemy Lacquer. But I have so many faves. As you can tell, I have a lot of polish for days and polish. Um, but those are some of my new faves and actually Alchemy Lacquer is not that new to me. I just really love everything I open from her. Okay. So next we're going to put a cream on my pointer finger just for funsies. And this is track star. And actually I'm going to take a second to put a base coat on. We're gonna do, we're gonna do. Oh, that's a matte top coat. Let's do Carolina's Liquid Magic Base Coat with Vitamin B12. Oof. Only Murders in the Building? <laughs> that's a show I didn't finish. Should I finish that, Wendy? Or anybody else who's finished it? I really like Steve Martin and um, Martin Short, but I don't know what was about that show that... I don't know. I did not find myself really loving it that much. Okay, that's gonna need a minute to dry. Oh no, it's raining sideways. You need a hit, a re-hit of that character's sass. Which character? You want to rewatch Miss Fisher now? Oh, you guys are getting me excited to watch it. Thanks, Jerry. You're loving this hand? This is going to be fun to wear all day, huh? Oh, shoot. I got to take this one off from last week. Only Murders was brilliant, JJ says. The doggos. Hi, Jessica. Aw. Well, you got to be there for her, so it's maybe good that you forgot. Okay. While we're waiting for this pointer finger to dry, just because I'm kind of looking at this symbol that I'm about to put on, thinking you look a little sus, sis. I think you're about to destroy my nails. Okay, on my thumb, this is not really aqua, but the mix of the blue and green and the flakies. This is Polish Fantasia, Black Friday 2021. 
You highly recommend. Okay, Flory, I'll just, I need to finish it. I'll finish it. I'll finish it for you, Flory. I love um, Morris watches for me from time to time from Sassy Nail Designs. And I love her thumbnail swatches. She just has gorgeous nail beds and so dexterous. Thumbs are hard for me because I have to hold it up like this. I don't know if you could really even see that that well. Look at this stuff. Isn't it neat? Wouldn't you think my nail polish collects incomplete? No, 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 no. It's like that one meme. No, no, no. Okay. Um, I'm going to push pause in just a second. Next season should be coming up soon. Really? Oh, your friend is starting her own brand. That's exciting, Tammy. Okay, maybe this wouldn't have stained me because it's kind of lighter on the teal side, but you never know. You'll never know just how much I love you. Barbara Streisand, circa probably 1972. Probably later. 1962. Okay, we're going to say stop. Tonight is your Manny night. My favorite. And have you chosen what you're going to do yet, Kim? Okay. The winning number is 96. 96, 96, 96, 66, 96. I have one more package I'm going to open with you guys. <clears throat> this is from Carolina. So she and I have a duo coming up for Mother's Day this year. And remember when we did the Mother Earth duo a million years ago? Well, I've been missing my friend. So we're going to do this duo together. She put such fun goodies in here. Oh, she's such a sweetie pie. Um, so it's going to be available from the 11th through the 17th on April. It's a pre-order for just those days. And it's inspired by the childhood book, I'll Love You Forever. That is just so, so sweet. It makes me cry every time. It has such a beautiful sentiment about mothers caring for their children and then children actually caring for their mothers or fathers when they reach a certain age when you now need to start caring for your parent. So this is what we're inspired by. So my polish, I'm going to show you in a second, is inspired by this picture. And her polish is inspired by this picture. And then there's one more picture of, well, the mom is holding him and he's an adult son. But then the next picture, which, oh, here we go. I just love this so much. It makes me cry every single time I look at this, you guys. I'm not going to cry, but it is so sweet. Um, so that's what we're inspired by. I'm going to show you guys these polishes really quick. Whew, okay, Color Secure has... Soy wax melts. I did not even know that. So she put in a sampling. This one is called Spring Rain. Very beautifully floral. Mmm, that's really pretty. Wow. That smells really nice. And then she has... Oh, this is another one. This is the Scent Cognac and Cubans. And it's in the little shape of a pineapple. And let's see what it smells like. Oh, interesting. That is really, really interesting and different. I like it. Okay, Carolina has little boxes now for her polishes. And they're so cute and pretty. And she has a hole in the bottom so you can see what the uh, polish name is so her polish is called my baby you'll be so do we have a winner Lara yay Lara so here is Carolina's polish so it is this soft lavender shade 
It's like a gray to lavender. And it is filled with Shifty Shimmer going pink to gold. And it has um, pink to purple iridescent flakies in it. And I think I'm going to have a video this week where I swatch. Um, actually, the video probably won't include this because they don't launch for a little minute. Here is mine. Again, inspired by the cover image. Do, 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 do. So this one's a little more boyishly feisty for the little boy tearing up the bathroom. And it has um, red gold flakies in there in that kind of grayish sailor blue. So these are only available as a set. Oh, mine is called As Long As I'm Living and hers is My Baby Will Be. So these are only available as a set for pre-order. You can get them on either of our website only for six days, seven days. So that was the last thing I needed to haul. Let us finish the swatching. Hi, Charlon. Oh, shoot. I'm so sorry you haven't been able to participate. Now you know how it goes, though, and you'll be able to participate with us next week. Actually, next week is our mix-along, so I hope you can come to that. And you also need to participate in that, too, because you guys help me decide what goes into the polishes we make. So if you want to watch me finish swatching these teals, they're kind of like turquoise -y teals. This one has a rainbow glitter mix in it. Oh, that's so pretty. This one is the Jasmine Polish from the new Polish for Days Princess Collection. And I think someone mentioned that it's not in stock right now. So there's going to be a restock soon. Wow, that one is pangin'. That one's awesome. Cuticula's collection coming out in April makes you tear up. Aww. I need to go look at her Instagram. I haven't seen it yet. Joey read it in Friends. Joey reads the book in Friends? Oh my gosh, I totally forget. Oh, both sites will have the polishes. Yep. Okay, this is the uh, polish, polish. You guys all know what I mean when I'm saying that, right? This is the one I think that was inspired by a car, right? And then this one is a several color sneaker texture, like sneaker-like texture called Trackstar. Oh, Vicky, I'm so happy. I'm so happy you do. Yay, Bama. Okay, Michelle, see ya. And yeah, I'll show really quick. Um, Kayla, the polish is coming on Friday. So we have new polishes coming on Friday, but then we're going to make polishes on Saturday. So usually people wait till after our new stuff is made on Saturday, and then you pick what you want from all the new stuff. But... Monday is the last day to order Boho Soul, which was our February, um, our February Facebook group exclusive, which is a teal linear holographic with strong fuchsia gold green shifty shimmer. This one is the Black Friday polish from Polish. I'm going to put a third coat on this when we're done and then seal them all with top coat to make sure these stay on for a few days. And yes, I only ever wear my manicures for a few days because I am swatching stuff. Okay, so the other things coming out on Friday. It's Friday, Friday. Um, Okay, so the Autism Acceptance Duo is coming out on Friday. So you have them to wear for April. And this month, they're not available for the whole month. They're just going to be one batch releases this time. But $5 from every bottle sold is going to be donated to a local nonprofit organization benefiting families of persons with autism. So we have Their Fight is My Fight, 
Salem has a shirt that says this and he wears it all the time and it makes me so happy. Most of his shirts have something to do with autism. And Salem is my oldest son, by the way. My second son has autism. Um, and autism ally. We're all autism allies, I think. Um, if you have anybody in your life who has autism and you're supportive of them and loving and accepting and... Um, advocating for them. Okay, so these are so cool together. So I was reading a lot of blogs the last couple months where um, I always know, I've always known that Autism Speaks is not an organization that really um, is, <laughs> what's a nice way to put it? Um, they're not the respectable organization. Um, where's my swatch wheel? And um, I can't find, I can't find my swatch wheel. I'll just get a new one. If you read any um, journalism from anybody who they themselves has autism, I have read a number this week saying that um, they would prefer if you want to spread autism awareness and autism acceptance that you wear red. So I've decided to make it a duo um, because I really love how these look together and I will show you in just a second. So um, their fight is my fight is a royal blue jelly. I just happen to really love, um, I do not really love autism speaks, but I do personally really enjoy blue and so does Lincoln, but he also happens to really love red. So, whoa, here's how that looks on its own. I'm going to show you how it looks with the topper in just a second. So here's how these dried down at two coats, by the way, I'm going to do a third coat on this one and on my thumb. So Autism Ally is um, a red to pink to gold shifty shimmer with two different kinds of multi-chrome flakies in there, red to bronze to copper and um, red to black multi-chrome flakies. And I'm going to show you how it looks when you put it over the blue, which is, I think, a nice message. Wearing them together, too, because... Um, no one stands alone. So this is just one coat of this, but I'm going to go ahead and top it because actually let me put on a third coat of this. So we'll make sure that's absolutely dry. So that's coming out on Friday. And so is the Facebook group exclusive, which Miranda designed. And it looks like, why isn't it in front of me? Let me grab it really quick. So, so cute. So, so cute. So we wanted to make this really pale blue, like the stone image. Let me show you guys the image. Do, 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 do. Here's the image that you guys voted to win. So we wanted to reflect that pale blue, but also that really ethereal pink and purple. So this polish is called Moonbeams in a Jar. So you've got a sheer blue with strong pink to gold to green and then you've got an additional shimmer that accents in there that's going sapphire to purple so it looks really cool together let me show you how these look now i'm gonna put autism ally over their fight is my fight and these are not only sold as a duo but there is going to there is going to be only one batch of both of them because of a component that I didn't have very much of and I have, it takes a long order time. So that's how they look together. I really love the combo. So um, there's that. Moonbeams in a Jar is the Facebook group exclusive. And then um, We Need an Adventure was a Black Friday 2020 um, small group custom. Uh, it, was, it was just for the Black Friday event. 
So I recreated it. I did not have a formula for it, so I had to do a lot of trying and testing and guessing. And it has maybe almost double the glitter <laughs> from the original. So that's Pinkie Pie in there in this kind of gray teal. <coughs> it has ho uh, silver hollow on a couple different sizes and then neon glitters. It's really, really fun. This one is only one batch. Um, Boho Soul is not near me, but I think I said before, you only have till Monday to pick that up if you want to. And then I was going to show you guys my um, next month's polish pickup shade is called a rusted development so it is a rust colored linear hollow with multi-chrome flakies the same ones that are in autism ally so there you have that stuff i'm going to say so long and go see how the girls poo poo cleanup is going thanks jj You guys hear Honor yelling at our dogs? <laughs> that child has like two volumes, quiet and then yell. So we're, we're working through that. All right, so here's my manicure for the week. Not for the week. <laughs> I'll be swatching in a couple days for the weekend. Okay. Aw, oh, thanks, Kim. Jerry, I feel you on that. And to just be totally honest with you, Lincoln isn't still totally potty trained. So I'm with you, boo. Okay, everybody. What am I selling in Vegas? Um, I'm going to be taking the new Encanto mix alongs because we made such fantastic shades last month. I'm going to be taking our event exclusive called Jackpot. <laughs> the VIP bag has a polish from me called Royal Flush. So you can probably guess what color that is. And I'm going to take the new Hero Princess collection, which has polishes for Aurora, Belle, Cinderella, Jasmine, Rapunzel, Moana. And the add-on is for Pocahontas, who is my favorite Disney princess. And, um, and yes. I agree, Louise. Um, so that's what's coming with me. Maybe some Project Do Bits, but that, mostly that stuff. So everybody, thanks for coming today to hang out. And to all the winners, congrats. And I am excited to see what you're going to pick. And I hope you have a fantastic, safe, warm enough weekend and a great week next week. And if you're having a little bit of a hard time right now, I just want to give you a hug. I want to send you all those purple hearts that Liz just sent me. Um, so, um, Rachel, after the event, there will be a few in the overpour section because I did have a few extra, but that's it. So I love you guys. And I know that some of you, even though you didn't express it here in this video are having a really hard time right now. So I just want to let you know that I love you and I would be there with you if I could, and you can make it through today or this week, today and this week, and things are going to get sunnier soon. So I hope that you have um, that with you this week if you're having a rough time. And everybody, I will see you later. See you back for a few uh, videos probably this next week and to create polish with me and Tim on Saturday. Shoot, I need to think about dressing up. What should Tim and I dress up as? Should we be tulips and we'll just stand here and go like this? I don't know. Maybe we'll get gardening clothes. All right, friends. Loves and hugs. And I will see you guys later. Mwah.